All right, my advanced crowd. I hope you guys all did your dynamic warm up and are ready to get that workout on. So let's go over the equipment that you're gonna need first. Medicine ball and or dumbbell, resistance band and a kettlebell and or dumbbell. So don't worry if you don't have these three things. All this can be done with body weight, a gallon jug of water, or just even a regular dumbbell, okay? The first superset that we are gonna do is gonna be overhead reverse lunges with potatoes. Don't worry, um, if you don't know what potatoes are, I'm gonna show you. And a superset is when you do two exercises back to back with no rest in between. So, with that being said, reverse lunges, overhead, grab your medicine ball, hold it straight up, go into a reverse lunge, you're gonna do 20 reps, and then you're gonna go straight into potatoes, holding your ball, knees slightly bent, then over at the waist, ball towards the ground, then overhead, just like this, okay? So it's down, straight overhead. And you're gonna do 15 of those. So, three sets of 20 overhead reverse lunges, followed immediately by three sets of 15 potatoes rest in between, then you're gonna go on to your next superset, which is going to be bent over rows with your resistance band and push-ups, okay? So loop your resistance band around something starting here. You are gonna do 15 reps, squeeze those shoulder blades when you pull that resistance band back, and then you're gonna go straight into push-ups. If you can't do them on your toes, go down to your knees, 15 of those. So you're gonna do three sets of 15 bent over rows, followed immediately by 15 push-ups, rest and repeat two more times. Your last superset is going to be kettlebell squat upright rows, supersetted with a kettlebell swing. So holding your kettlebell, feet, apart, you're going to squat, upright row, squat, upright row, elbows up towards the ceiling, bring that kettlebell up to your chin, and then you're going to go straight into kettlebell swings. So you're going to squat, get that momentum going, and swing it up over your head. So you're doing 15 of the squat upright rows, immediately followed by 15 of the swings, three sets of those, okay, resting in between. And then when you're done, I want you to do some static stretching, loosen those muscles up, and then get, that way you can recover for the next one. 